what is up it's your girl i'm back um so as i said in probably some vlogs i'll post that i never posted that i was traveling to ghana but i wanted to surprise my friends so i really didn't post much about it this trip has been very very stressful so i really didn't get to vlog Right now I'm in Togo, and if you don't know where Togo is, Togo is Ghana's neighboring country, so I just landed in Togo. So right now, I'm about to wait about two hours, then um, take a flight to Accra, Ghana. So, we'll see. I'll talk to you guys more once. I pass check out and stuff. Hey guys, so I am on my way home. And I'm traveling to the downtown for a good job. But I'm very upset because my bags did not come. Just my hand luggage and one bag came through. And right now, my dad came to pick me up. myself like i know my father like when my dad says i'm going out so can you wait for me before i come back it's never he's probably somewhere chatting he said i'm walking someone down the street and he's still not here like you know my friends are not he there yet so it's fine but like still i told you eight guys oh my gosh I need some sleep. I'm about to have some Tylenol and just sleep. <laughs> My bags!
My bags are not here, so like I'm not really gingered for this trip. I wasn't really gingered to come to Ghana this year, which is very shocking. <laughs> but yeah, the Vim, the Vim, no day like that. But guys, let me go shower before Botty hey, will text me and see where am I because I'm gonna go say hi to my auntie and my cousin who live down the street even before I go. So yeah. So guys, I'll catch you guys on my walk when I'm going to see my cousin. I'm about to be on my way. But obviously I'm cooking my edges. Cause the way <laughs> I'm sweating like a sheep is abnormal. It's insane. It's abnormal. Are you normal? Like it's insane, it's insane, it's insane. I'm having a call right now guys. Um, Let me, let me, let me, guys, let me, let me get going. Because I don't want to miss my bag. But yeah, guys, I'm cooking my edges. I'll take it out. Maybe when I sit in the car. Right now, I'm walking to my um, cousin's place. So we'll see. Hey, guys. So I know I didn't update you guys. I finally got my bags yesterday. And I just had to, like, make sure everything was in it. So right now I'm ready. I'm out and about <laughs> delivering stuff. So my Uber is here in like a minute or so. So I'm about to leave. And we'll talk later. Hold on one second, guys. friday december 17th um a few days christmas is getting closer and closer but this morning it is like what time is it right now it is 9 50 i'm actually running late i'm supposed to pick up my cousin my brother my big brother 
from the airport. I haven't seen him in eight years. He's my cousin, but we grew up together in the same house, my in my mom and dad's house. We grew up here together. And he actually went to um Atomic Hills as well when he came from Germany. So that's like my big brother. A lot of people know him as my big brother. So he's arriving today. I haven't seen him in eight years since 2013 when we all left Ghana. Like we all decided to go back to like where we're from. If you can say that. Even though we're from Ghana, but we all decided to like go back to like where we were born or whatever so i haven't seen him in eight years so i'm actually excited because this christmas i'm gonna be seeing my cousins i haven't seen in years i haven't seen him in eight years he's the one that i re i recently saw compared to my other cousins i haven't seen them in a very very long time it's over 10 years since i haven't seen them they're all arriving one of my cousins is arriving tomorrow and then my cousin um crystal is arriving next the, this coming week and then my other cousin is arriving um few days after christmas as well so i'm actually excited so we're about to go pick him up it is 9 50 something i'm supposed to be getting ready meeting my friend at hacha kfc then drive the reason why the airport to my house is not even that far but traffic in accra is mad but december traffic in accra is madder so everywhere you're going you really have to factor in the traffic you have to factor in the time that it takes to get there on a normal day no no traffic in fact now factor in the traffic as well because the traffic is unpredictable you can be in traffic for a very long time even though the flight arrives like at like in midday but you know by the time i get ready take a shower request a ride and get to hacho it probably would be 11 something then if my friend is not there i have to wait for them if he's there we have to drive all the way to the airport that's another traffic as well so without further ado let me go get ready and i'll talk to you guys when i'm ready about to leave or so right now i am at kfc um, I'm waiting for a friend here. This was where we were supposed to meet and go to the airport and pick up my cousin. But um, the person is not here yet. So I'm like just waiting right now. The heat in Accra is mad, but that's what you get when you live in a country that has 24 7 heat. So yeah, um, traffic is mad as well. But it's a busy day. Our car is always busy. Like it's always bus, it's always busting or whatever. So I'm just sitting down and waiting. Um, my cousin's flight. Oh no, thank you. My cousin's flight should arrive by now or like in two minutes technically. And I'm not even at the airport. And it's like my friend is not even here for us to be even on our way to say like, oh, by the time he's done with check-in and everything, like, what's it called? We will be there. <laughs> Yo, I should have just said meet me at the airport because that would have been way smarter. Just because at least if, if anything, like I'm there to meet him. And then we could just wait for my friend to come if he's running late. But now both of us is gonna be late. My cousin hasn't been to Ghana in eight years. So yeah, that's, this is his first time after eight years when he left Ghana again. So, oh guys, and I finally got yogurt. I got yogurt, like I got fun your gods bro you guys don't know what this actually like means let me guys let me show you i hear when people stare because why are you staring but you know it's a ghanian thing we stare till death like like they will stare at you for like with, with no shame they'll let you know say yes but let me show you what fun Fun you got is uh, uh, 
this is funny but so so an ice cream this is strawberry flavored yogurt if you come to ghana and you don't have fun yogurt or any fun milk product you didn't come to ghana you're slacking i got three just because what's it called i got some from my friend and his girlfriend as well and then there's this yeah but hold on guys uh <laughs>
me, yeah Trap me, say, hold up, yo Spend my last in your mind